There is much concern about the proposed World Health Organization pandemic treaty. The concerns fall into two categories. One, what is actually happening? What are the key dates? And two, many people feel there are strong arguments against such a treaty being ratified. A later video to be released in the next few days will examine the arguments against such a treaty. This video seeks to clarify what is actually happening and the time frame involved. This article from The Lancet, a weekly peer-reviewed general medical journal, shows some of the key dates and some of the rationale behind such a treaty. The article states that at the 75th World Health Assembly from May 22 to May 29, 2022, there is an opportunity to examine progress in revising the international health regulations and to discuss further a pandemic treaty. In the opinion of the article authors, the process of forming such a committee has been too slow. It also states that the Intergovernmental Negotiating Body's progress report is not expected until 2023. But what is the World Health Assembly? The World Health Assembly is the decision-making body of the World Health Organization. It is this assembly that is meeting from 22nd of May to 29th of May 2022. By a seeming coincidence, the World Economic Forum also has its annual meeting from the 22nd of May to the 26th of May. At their meeting, the World Health Assembly will hold a series of strategic roundtables, the themes of which were introduced during the Director General's opening remarks at the 150th session of the WHO Executive Board. The theme that concerns us is to urgently strengthen the WHO as the leading and directing authority on global health at the centre of the global health architecture. This theme and the relevant dates were supported by a European Council press release on 3rd of March 2022. On that day, the Council adopted a decision to authorise the opening of negotiations for an international agreement on pandemic prevention, preparedness and response. A negotiating body was tasked with drafting and negotiating this international instrument and at its next meeting on 1st of August 2022, progress on a working draft would be discussed. We now come to something that troubles many people. The Council noted that a convention, agreement or other international instrument is legally binding under international law. We will return to this in our next video in a few days, but for now, the entire matter and timetable is well summed up by a member of the European Parliament, Christine Anderson. She stated that on 1st December 2021, the 194 members of the World Health Organization reached a consensus to begin the process of drafting and negotiating a convention, agreement or other international instrument under the constitution of the World Health Organization to strengthen pandemic prevention, preparedness and response. And an intergovernmental negotiating body will now be constituted and hold its first meeting by March 2022 to agree on ways of working and timelines, and its second by 1st of August 2022, to discuss progress on a working draft. It will then deliver a progress report to the 76th World Health Assembly in 2023 with the aim to adopt the instrument by 2024. The process described and the dates exactly agrees with those published by the European Council. But she then asked the question, 
That will form the core of this channel's next video on the proposed pandemic treaty. She asks, to what extent will the Commission ensure that the citizen who has no direct vote in a body such as the WHO is not bypassed in the decision-making process and that a shift of competence further and further away from the voter does not lead to an increasing de-democratization of our society. This question exactly mirrors the long-held concern of this channel. That there exists a global network of organisations and people we did not vote for that are controlling the governments we did vote for. This community combines the topics of climate change, COVID-19 and the New World Order. If you would like to join our community, you can find us on locals.com. The New World Order. This link will take you directly to our site.